Hey you guys, way back guy here. We're back with more Lonely Mountains Downhill. Lonely Mountains Downhill. We have made it to Mount Riley. Let's go ahead and jump into the game right away, guys, here. So this is Mountain 4. This is a DLC mountain. Um, let me show you here. Let me actually go back. Let me go into the mountain. We're going to go with uh, trail number 1. Have we unlocked it? doesn't look like we've unlocked trail number 2 because uh, we got to do the challenges. Uh, we did this like from the very first stream of the series of uh, Lonely Mountains. I went through like one trail on each mountain, but now we're going by mountain by mountain. So this is mountain four. This is Mount Riley. Uh, we got to do, it looks like explored. I guess I didn't even finish this. I didn't know. I guess maybe I didn't finish it. Anyways, guys, so I did a poll. I, I asked people like, what bike should I get? So let me jump to this real fast here. So this is a, a Reddit post. I asked people on the Lonely Mountains Downhill Reddit, what bike should I buy? And it looks like overwhelmingly people said, get the boar bike. Uh, I asked about like the javelin. Some people said uh, one get eight ball said on Reddit that uh, the r road bike in real life it's a great ride, but I wouldn't use it on a mountain biking game. Uh, and looks like another uh, user said uh, Geronimo's great for exploring, but he's biased towards the Trailblazer. But it looks like overwhelmingly the people on Reddit said get the boar bike. So I think. I'm going to get the boar bike, guys. So here's the bike options we have. So boar is this one right here. Looks like it has very little stability, but has a lot of agility. It has decent sprinting. It's got um, quite a lot of shock absorption, pretty crummy acceleration, but a lot of grip. So I don't know. It costs six parts to buy it. Uh, let's go ahead and unlock it, guys. Let's go ahead and get the boar bike, because supposedly people said they really liked this bike, apparently. So uh, here we go. We got the boar bike, guys. We got the boar bike. We could also customize it. Uh, we could give it a different paint job. Looks like there's only two types. There's uh, sellers. Actually, I kind of like the looks of that one. That's kind of cute. Can we go with that, or do we have to unlock it? Okay, go back. Oh, cool. We got it. Okay, cool, guys. So we got the boar bike. So we're going to use the boar bike on uh, Mount Riley. Let's do this. Let's do this. Well, that's a pretty colorful bike. All right, here we go, guys. So we're on Mountain 4, so it's going to be getting a bit more difficult. Um, this will probably be a shorter stream tonight because I'm not going to really be trying to do a whole bunch of challenges. I'm just going to get through Mountain 4 now. Uh, last stream was a really long stream for this type of a game. Um, it was like about a, oh, I don't know, two and a half hours long or something because I was trying to get all those bike parts. So that was checkpoint one. Oh, I didn't see how many checkpoints there were. I'm playing it real safe right now, guys. I'm not even going off road at all right now. I'm sticking to the main drag here. Uh, this is just explore. Oh no, we fell. This is just explore mode, so we can um, actually uh, pretty much just go crazy if we wanted to go crazy here. Uh, so I can do. Looks like oh no, looks like there was. I looked like kind of maybe a shortcut there, but I don't know. Like if I go really slow here, I can't even actually really see any options for shortcuts. Let me slow down here. If I, you know, if I, I don't know how to get out of that when you get stuck like that, guys. I think kind of if you sprint, you can get out of it, but not always. Hi. Okay. Going downhill for sure right now. Uh, pretty, pretty tame though. Pretty tame. Not very, uh, oh, dying. Not very, uh, steep or not anything like that. All right. So yeah, they really want me to kind of, I'm just accelerating as I'm going downhill. Whoa. Accelerate when I'm going downhill here, guys. I want to see if I can, uh. Uh, no, what did I hit? What did I hit? It looked like it was maybe a, a bush or something. Oh, could I have... I, <laughs> so Some of the deaths are pretty funny. 
Could I go down this way? It looked like he could kind of go this way. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I think I am going this way. Oh my god. Oh, we found a crazy shortcut, guys. That was pretty cool. Look at that. That was an awesome shortcut. Yeah. Oh man, it's been a week since I last played this game. I'm trying to get used to the controls. Wow, that's weird. The drone footage or whatever, the camera angle, it kind of pulled out. Now it's kind of going behind me like a first person perspective almost. They're doing some weird sort of camera work in this uh, level, it seems like. You gotta move the camera around quite a bit though because, of, well, let's do a sprint there. Because uh, of all the uh, foreground polygons and whatnot. I wonder if that was actually kind of difficult to uh, to design in the game. The uh, the camera angle is really, whoa, oh, no. Oh, that was lucky. Where is the next short, uh, where, shortcut? Where's the next, uh, the next checkpoint, guys? It's been, Seems like it's been a while since a checkpoint. I wonder if I missed a checkpoint there at the beginning of the of a level. Because I took like a shortcut. I'm going real slow here. Oh, we did get a checkpoint. Okay. There was just there was just a long time between checkpoints, apparently. I'm not sure how many checkpoints are in this level. Let's just go ahead and sprint. Go. So the way I have the control set in the game is uh when I go left on my gamepad, he's got ooh, <laughs> he goes left on his bike. And when, when I go right on my gamepad analog stick, he goes right on his bike. You can set the controls to be um, to be relevant to like whichever way the camera angle is facing. So like I'm going downhill right now uh, toward myself. So if I pressed left on the uh, analog stick, I would have been moving to the his right. Um, that is the default uh, control scheme, but I prefer, uh, you know, when I go left, he's go he goes left, you know, from his perspective. It seems to be, I don't know, it seems to be easier for me to understand that than, uh, than, um, the other control scheme. But I do appreciate that they give you options there. We're doing not so bad, aren't we, guys? We're not really hitting any of those shortcuts. Oh, yeah, we got the boar bike now, so we should be, ouch! I was gonna say, we should be able to probably do some pretty good drops. Oh, wow, looks like we could go, no! Okay, we did it. Looks like you could go, like, way over here. Like, way down there. Okay, that's gonna obviously kill us there. But if I go real slow here, maybe we can drop? Let's see. This is crazy steep, guys. I don't know. Oh, no. We almost did it. We almost did. Let's see. Oh, no. That didn't work. All right. So, maybe maybe, maybe can't be done. Let's see. I go a little low. Oh, man. This is too steep. Oh, whoa. I can't even see. The tree's in the way. <laughs> they didn't want to show us how bloody the death was, I guess. All right. I guess we got to stick to the regular. Whoa. Stick to the regular road, guys. I don't know. I don't know if the boar bike is. I, I don't know. I can't even really tell if it's much better than the other bike or not. That I began with. I did. It does. Woo. Ah. That made me. That made me die there. Didn't even give me a chance, really. It seems to. You know, it seems like it doesn't have as much acceleration as the. Um, I think it was the Grasshopper, the original bike in the game. Uh, but it does seem to be a bit faster. It seems like it has a higher top speed or something. I don't know. No, no, no. Oh, man. Oh, man. This is a tough level, guys. Um, yeah, I don't know what the challenges are going to be to unlock the next trail. Uh, hopefully it's going to be like, you know, 19 crashes or less, because I've had quite a few crashes already. Of course, this might, this might be, I don't even really remember this level, guys. Maybe I didn't, uh, maybe I didn't do this trail in the very first live stream I did of this game. Like, I don't know, about a month ago or something. There we go, there's our checkpoint. Man, this, man, when it goes like that, like side-scroller mode, man, that's just really tricky because I'm used to going left, right, you know, going left, right in a two-dimensional plane, uh, not 3D. Ooh, jeez. We could have uh, actually taken a shortcut there, the bottom of the hill. Man, there's, like, trees everywhere we could run into. Man, it's tricky. It gets really tight uh, with these turns, too. Whoa, see, that was that shortcut. I was talking about. It looks like there's another shortcut here, maybe. Yeah, there we go. It's almost easier to do the shortcut than to do all the way around with the uh, switch back there. Okay, where's our where's our checkpoint? There we go. Oh, okay, there's the bottom. Wow, man. Okay, that was actually kind of tough, guys. They don't get to, they don't show you what your time is though when you do the first run of it. Uh, so now we get to see what our challenges are. Uh, let me go ahead and uh, I don't know if any of you guys want to uh, chat, but I'm gonna go ahead and pop out the chats just in case I I can see your chat messages. I'm streaming right now on, um, I stream on YouTube, uh, Twitch, and, uh, Kick right now. Um, should I pull these out earlier? I apologize, guys. Give me a second. Just in case you guys want to say anything. I know it's late. It's late where I am, at least. 
I was going to stream earlier. I had some quote unquote technical difficulties. I won't bore you with it though. All right, so let's go into uh, Mount Riley. Here we go. Got the chats pulled up. All right, so that was Five Finger Lakes. Uh, we need to finish. We need to go back into Five Finger Lakes, and we need to unlock the next trail. Eighteen crashes or less, guys. So eighteen crashes or less. There is seven checkpoints. Actually, really just six. The seventh checkpoint is the end. We'll go ahead and stick with Boar, I guess. Uh, so we got two bike parts left. So if I want to unlock another bike, I could do it. Uh, on that Reddit, uh, I'll look. When I die, I'll take a look again. See what was the second place result on that poll I did online. They definitely, ha I guess they have different paint jobs uh, based on uh, the bike that you get. Because this is, I rem I'm really digging this paint job. It's really, uh, really cool looking. The f with the forks, um, you know, the front forks, they're uh, really colorful, pretty cool. Pretty cute. I'd like a bike like that. That's a cool looking bike. I don't own any uh, mountain, uh, I don't own any mountain bikes right now. Uh, so right now, it looks like the, uh, the second uh, place result in that poll I did online, uh, people liked the Trailblazer bike. Three people liked that. Seven people liked the Boar bike, so that's why I went ahead and uh, got myself the Boar bike. And then there was like the two top bikes that cost the most bicycle parts were the Javelin bike and the, um, the Geronimo bike. And they both cost eight bike parts. So that's why I was working so hard to try to get um, all the bike parts because I thought maybe those would be the best bikes. But it looks like only one person said they like the Javelin the most, and then two people like the Geronimo bike the most. So most people really like this bike. I don't know why. I'm guessing because it's kind of a, uh, a middle ground, maybe. I don't know, because when I was looking at the stats, they didn't seem to be all that much different. There were, there were slight variations, but it didn't seem like actually the most expensive bikes. Yikes. That was tricky. I can't believe I did that like in the first try, I think, when I played this uh, level. We got two crashes, guys. Uh, not many people actually commented on the poll, so uh, I don't know why they like the boar the most. I guess I could have asked. The poll lasted for, I think, about like five days or something online. I'm sorry. I guess I should have told you guys. You, you guys should have gone and voted on it if you had possibly played this game before. I didn't know. Oh, wow. Okay. I had, I had to sprint over that because I didn't know if I was going to make it or not. All right. Here we go. They definitely um, seem to make you want to stick. Oh! Oh, no! They definitely seem to want to make you stick to the main trail here. I'm not finding a lot of opportunities for shortcuts. I mean, look over here. It looks like there's a shortcut right here I could do. There we go. Nice. There we go. We just saved a little bit of time. I could probably do that a little bit more, but I, ah, I'm a little scared to do that. All I want to really do is just finish this level with uh, as few crashes as possible. So then I'm going to go slow here, guys. This is scary. <laughs> That's scary. Oh, wow. Okay. Now, I, I might have died there um, with the original Grasshopper bike because of uh, the drop. Uh, and it doesn't have very good stability. I think this bike has really good stability. Is that right? Or, or it does have it does have really bad stability. I don't remember. But I'm actually doing all right. It didn't say personal best there, so I'm actually not doing that great. Maybe? Or I don't know. In the Explorer mode, it might not keep track of your times and stuff. Uh, is this a full suspension bike, guys? I didn't even notice. I'm going to try to look a little closer here in a second. I'm not so focused on uh, the trail. I'm kind of just watching the trail as it appears on the edge of the screen. Ouch. Ouch. Okay, I think it's a... Uh, let's turn around here. I think it's actually a hardtail. I don't think it is full suspension bike. So that might be why we're getting, that might be why we're getting more speed because um, with more suspension, you're going to get more bounce back. You're going to get more wasted energy and you're not going to be able to go as fast. So that might be why it seems like we're getting a bit more speed than we would otherwise with like a real, I would, I would call a real downhill mountain bike, a bike with uh, full suspension, you know, with suspension both in the front forks and the back. But I don't know. I don't know. I'm a, I'm a kid of the 80s, so, uh, you know. Mountain bikes were a big thing, and hybrid bikes were a big thing back in the 80s, and uh, it was a big deal if you could get a bike with, like, a uh, front suspension. And that was what, you know, would typically be considered a, a mountain bike. But you can get mountain bikes. With a, you know, they got a lot of options for mountain bikes uh, with full suspension. They're still really expensive, though. They're, I think they're probably some of the most expensive bicycles you can buy is a downhill full suspension mountain bike. It'll set you... I mean, it used to set you back, like two, three grand. It might be even more than that now, especially if you get one of the fancier brand names. Oh, no. <laughs> okay, so we're doing pretty good, guys. I am playing it very safe. I don't know what I don't know what the what the uh, time was we had to beat. It looks like two minutes, 40 seconds. So we're going way too slow to uh, to get that time. 
That's okay. I think it might have been a bike part or a paint job. I didn't know. All right, so there's the end case. Uh, that took me, it looks like three, yeah, three minutes, eight seconds, and we need to do it in two minutes, 40 seconds. So we were we were quite a ways off, about by 30 seconds, but we had 18 crashes less. We only had um, four crashes, guys. That's actually pretty good. So we unlocked the next trail, guys. We unlocked the next trail. So let's go to the next trail here for Mount Riley. Looks like there's five trails in Mount Riley. It is a um, DLC. Titan Peak, guys. Titan Peak. Let's take a look at this. Looks like we got seven checkpoints and then the finish. So there are seven real checkpoints uh, that we'll go through. We need to unlock the challenges by doing the exploration mode. We'll stick with Boar because Boar seems to be a pretty good bike. Oh, we're up high because you don't see much uh, foliage at all. I think there's a little bit of snow or something going on. I don't know. I thought I saw like a little bit of dust or something in the air. Maybe it wasn't snow. I don't know if there's any snowy levels in this game. I wouldn't know how you would even ride through that. Uh, we're taking it kind of slow right here. Man, guys. <laughs> there's like, I mean, I know there's no guardrails when you're going down a, a mountain, but um, this is pretty scary. All right, this is, a, this is easy here. It's all wide open there. There we go. Got a checkpoint. Okay, we're going this way now. They're changing the camera angle on us. Going this way. Uh, Kai? Yeah, man, it, it is, it is, I, th I think we're getting, I think it's, I think I'm having a little less crashes because the game is being more forgiving with this bicycle when I hit, like, the little rocks and stuff. When I hit the little rocks with the original bike, the Grasshopper bike, I mean, it was, like, game over, pretty much. <laughs> I was getting, uh, game overs all, all, I was getting, uh, crashes all the time with that Grasshopper bike. But it wasn't that bad of a bike. In fact, actually, on Reddit, one person said they liked it. The <gasps> what? Oh, okay, I had to jump there, I didn't realize. All right, let's up. Uh, oh no! Woo! He did a cool uh, little, uh, cool little trick there. We jumped over there. Oh, dying! We're jumping again. Okay. All right. All right. We got this, guy. Man, we're jumping back and forth. Oh! oh! Ooh, that hurt. That hurt. That was pretty bad. <laughs> That's cool. He kind of does a little trick there when he's uh, doing the jump. We got one more jump up here coming up. Big jump. There we go. Slow it down, birdies. Another jump. Now it's coming down pretty fast. Coming down pretty fast down this section. Oh wow, there are rocks everywhere. Oh, I didn't know which way to go, left or right, and that's what ends up getting you uh, hurt when you're mountain biking. Is like left, right, left, right. You gotta make a decision and just stick with it and just do it and uh, ride it out. When you're indecisive, that's when you get hurt. That's when you get hurt. <laughs> Ooh, we somehow did not die there. I can't. Ow, the same dang rock, guys. The same dang rock. All right, here we go. Try to get a little more. Oh, I was going to try to do it a little faster. I'm holding down the sprint button. Try to do this a little faster. Whee! This is such a fun game. I am enjoying this game. Hey, Mark, on YouTube. Ow! I go to read the, the chat comments. Hope you're recovering well. Oh, yes, I am recovering all right. I did uh, fall down a while back um, on the pavement and... Uh, Injured, injured my ribs and my... I uh, know we're dead, guys. <laughs> At least I wasn't like that guy. I didn't run to that tree. Right now, it's mainly um, mainly my uh, my wrists. My wrists are hurt. I sprained both wrists. Ah, uh, crack, guys. Oh, yeah, we did. We did. I don't... I think if you, like, turn your bike about, uh, you know, 45-degree angle or something on the... On the uh, Air, while you're airborne, you're <laughs> look at that. Look at that. You can't land like that. You gotta land uh, with your your uh, bicycle wheels um, forward. You know. So that's pfft, man. I'm having a lot of trouble. Fortunately, this. Oh wait, I'm not, I didn't even sprint that time, guys. It looks like. Let me just try this. Can I actually get across there without sprinting? No, the bike's not fast enough. If I had the javelin bike, maybe I could. But you definitely got to sprint with this bike to get across. Ow! I mean, the bike was called the Boar, so I was kind of thinking Boar. Well, then it's going to be kind of slu sluggish or something. But this definitely seems like a pretty good bike. I'm liking this bike. Okay, I don't think I... Yeah, I didn't need to sprint there because I had enough acceleration. I'm not sprinting there either. Ooh! I, um, I think I needed to sprint there. All right, here's this crazy section, guys. This section is... I didn't get past this section last time. All right, so now I've gotten further than I've gotten. Let's get up here. I'm going to use that sprint. There we go. Oh, dying... I think we needed a sprint there. I don't know. We got a sprint here. Oh, I was trying to... Pa Wait a minute. I think there's a shortcut if I go, like, way over here. <laughs> no, that doesn't work. Okay, they want us to go this side here, I think. There's probably a shortcut to be done there. It looks like there was another shortcut I could have cut through. 
I, if I do die and I have to restart from... I'm looking all around, man. That's pretty waterfall. If I do have to restart from the checkpoint, then I'll uh, see if I can try that. Uh, see if I can try that shortcut. Oh, what the... What's up over there? I don't know what's up over there. We need to go down this way, though. Oh, crap. <laughs> Looks like we were about to go through a cave. Oh, jeez. Okay, fine. <laughs> Just sprint here. There we go. It looked like there was maybe a shortcut to be had right here, guys. Is that right? Yeah, look at that. There we go. We just shaved a, shaved a bunch of time right by doing that. So there's like a lot of little shortcuts like that in this game. Here's the, uh... Oh, it wasn't really a cave. It was just kind of going underneath something. Could have saved some time there by just going straight. It's okay. Uh, what? I didn't even see what checkpoint that was, guys. We must be getting near the end of the trail. Oh, gosh. I was... I, was, I just look off to the side of the screen just for a second. You know, it's a racing game. That's what happens. Uh, I was trying to see, like, what section I was on. But it doesn't tell you what section you're on when you're doing the Explorer mode. But that was checkpoint 5. So there's actually... Oh, crap. There's actually, um... Two more checkpoints after this checkpoint. And then this the finish. I'm using the brake quite a bit here, this section. Man, I can't even see, whoa. It's like you can't see what's coming up on you sometimes, like at all. And then, ah, ooh. Oh, wow, somehow I'm still alive there. And then there's like all this, the, like the trees and stuff pop in the foreground and that really kind of can mess you up. It's definitely a fun game, though. Oh, shit. Okay. <laughs> oh, no. What is kind of a death is that? What is kind of a death is that? He died, and he went, ah. Okay, fine. That's all right. That's all right, guys. Let's try it again. Let's try it again. Oh, crap. Let's try it again. <laughs> We're still alive. How are we still alive, guys? Oh, no. Am I stuck forever? I think I can actually kill myself by pressing, uh, yeah, pressing the, the death key or whatever. There's actually a death key. You can kill yourself and just give up. All right. Man, this is trick. This, this mountain is def- Ow, crap. This mountain is definitely, uh, more tricky than the other mountains. I didn't know if it was going to be more tricky or not because it is, a. Uh, it was released after the initial release of the game. So I guess they're just, they're supposed to be more challenging levels. And there's one, oh, <laughs> and there's one more mountain after this mountain too. So we'll play that next week. Okay, we haven't have we we haven't even completed this trail yet, have we, guys? This is the first. Uh, this is like the explorer round. Okay, now there's going to be a section here. What I need to do a big jump. I forget where it's at. It's coming up though. I think it's like all of a sudden it wanted me to jump, and I did. Yeah, I didn't know. Is it coming? I think it's coming up here. Here it is. You jump. Oh, wow. <gasps> wow. Okay, that was good, guys. <laughs> that was lucky. That was just lucky, really. Going down pretty fast here. All right. I think you can tell when the when the mountain starts getting more uh, flattened out. It's, uh... It's, it's... You're getting near the bottom of the mountain. And you can tell, guys, the trees are, like, really green now. This is such a cool game. I don't know if there's any other neat, uh, like, mountain biking games or something if anyone has any suggestions just leave them in the chat or uh, in the video comments or you can go to my discord at uh discord.waybackguy.com because when i oh i don't want to actually go that way <laughs> they, they always trick me when they have like the uh the uh forks in the road like that oh there we go <laughs> We did it! We just crashed into our own tent. All right, cool, guys. We did it. That was Trail 2 on Mount Riley. Lonely Mountains Downhill. Okay, so let me... Uh, that was just the Explorer mode, guys. That was the Explorer mode. So let me go back into it again and see what the challenges are. Okay, so to unlock the next trail, we need 20 crashes or less. I'm not sure how many crashes I did last time, guys. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Woo! Whoa, that was a little fast. <laughs> now, I, I don't. I have not seen an option or a challenge where it's like get down to the bottom of the mountain and do it in zero crashes or less. Um, I think there has been some challenges that are like four crashes or less, which is pretty crazy. Uh, and that's to unlock I don't know things like bike parts or whatever. All right, so we got a. Uh, I, I, I almost hit the sprint there, and I was going to go uh, to the left, but the, actually the game did not want me to go that way. Actually, I might have been able to go that way, guys, but um, not with this bike. That's why I kind of wanted to get... I, I could 
I could have gotten the Geronimo bike because I could have seen like how much I could have really pushed it, like going down big descents and stuff and just landing, like smash landing with the, uh, the suspension. I imagine it wasn't going to be that great. You know, it's going to be still something. Well, I think I'm going to shortcut. Yeah, I didn't even mean to do that. Uh, it's still going to be kind of realistic. That was, oh crap. That was going to be checkpoint. That was a checkpoint two. That's okay. It's all right that we uh, crashed there. I needed to hit the sprint button. I didn't hit the sprint button. That's why I crashed. All right, so that was the first crash, I think. Yeah, we only have one crash so far. Now I was having difficult... Uh, I think this section of the trail I was having the most crashes. So let's just take it easy when we get down here. I'm going to go kind of slow. Uh, I haven't seen anything like a proper rock garden in the game yet. I don't know if there is anything like that in the game. Oh, jeez. <laughs> We're gone. It's over. Yeah, okay, we did. It's okay. It's okay. We only had two crashes so far. Yeah, we got through that. Oh, <laughs> Just crashed into the flowers there or whatever. Uh, we've had a... And then we can cut through right here, guys. Remember? There we go. Nice quick little shortcut there. I do... I would like to kind of... We now. I would kind of like to um, ugh, explore a little... Oh, man, guys. I don't know... I don't think there is a checkpoint right there. I would like to explore a little bit more... Um, all right, how do we get out of that? Oh, <laughs> okay. Uh, we were able to get out of that. Um, man, I did it again. Okay, and I just kind of feathered the um, the acceleration button on the gamepad, and I was able to go uh, recover from that, so to speak. All right, nice and easy, nice and easy. Going around and through the cave we go. And I missed that shortcut again, guys. It was like the little shortcut straight away there I could have used. Hit the sprint button once, would have shaved maybe a second or so off my time. That's okay. We're not going to get the. Uh, we're not going to. We're probably not going to get the uh, the fast time. Or, oh, there was actually a shortcut there. Probably not going to get the uh, the uh, the time. Yeah, crap, guys. Probably not going to get the uh, fast time on this. This is only my second time going down the trail, anyway. Um, <laughs> oh man, that is painful. That looks so painful. And I, I'm wondering, like, what is the backstory in this game? You know, like. Is this the same guy? He's just doomed to repeat the, 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 the section over and over and over again? They don't even have... Oh, wait. No, 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 no. <gasps> we almost recovered from that, guys. I don't know how we would have almost recovered from that. Ah, jeez. All right. All right, so I'm having trouble with this section, guys. So I'm just going to use the... <laughs> I was going to say, I was going to use the brake a little bit more. Hey there on YouTube. I'll uh, read your chat message in a second. Oh my gosh, guys. All right, I'm gonna go kind of slow here. Okay, I could have I could have taken a shortcut there. All right, here we go. <laughs> all right, all right, here we go. All right, we need to jump there. Okay, very good. I think there's a yeah, there's a, a checkpoint right there, guys. This is uh, we've had nine crashes so far. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, what section is this? This is sec. I'm trying to read it. Uh, is in the upper. Oh, it's in the upper left. That's why I wouldn't be able to find it. We're in section seven of eight. So we're not in the last section. We're almost in the last section. I am noticing that when I go back and forth on my bike, like I'm, I'm using the steering like hard left, hard right, it does actually uh, slow you down a bit. Almost acts like a, um, a brake in a way. I mean, I could have done that a lot faster, guys, but I was going left, right, left, right on the uh, gamepad. On the analog stick. Yikes. All right, so this is the last section, guys. We're almost at the end. Uh, no, I did it again. I got tricked there. I thought that was, let's just, oh, ooh, that looked painful. We hit the, we hit the bridge there, guys. I was going to hit this, uh, the, the sprint button right there because I thought that was like the end and I was going to, uh, just sprint to the very end there and to just crash into the tent or whatever again, like I did the first time when I completed the level. All right. All right, let's go carefully across here. Oh, there's the end right there. We need to sprint. Oh, so we did need to sprint there at the end with the, uh, the bridge or whatever. All right, so let's uh, go on to, I guess, the next trail, guys. Because um, we did that, so that unlocked the next trail. Uh, there are there are expert and free rider modes. So let me take a look at this for a second, guys. What is free rider? Cross the finish line. Unlock secret reward? What? Oh, I didn't know. So there's stuff like that you can do in this game? I didn't know that. So if I go back to the first trail... There's a free rider mode. Complete all beginner uh, challenges to unlock. Oh, okay. Interesting. So there is actually another thing you can get. And I could get a reward for that, guys? Should I try it? Cross the finish line. All I got to do is just cross the finish line. But what? In so many few crashes or not? I don't know. Let's go ahead and redo it, I guess.
Hey there on YouTube, you say uh, Descenders is another game, but it's more like Mountain Bike Simulator. Descenders, huh? Descenders. Okay, I'll uh, I'll, t I'll look it up after the, after the stream tonight. Thanks for the uh, suggestion. I don't play many simulator ga ga uh, games, guys, but I am playing Voices of the Void on Wednesday right now. That is like the one and only genre of video games I just don't play that much. Um, I don't know why. I, I, uh, I guess because, you know, it, it is a high learning curve often with a lot of simulator games. Although I guess I, I'm thinking of the simulator games of the past. Uh, newer simulator games typically may not be as complicated. I mean, there's some simulator games where like you use every single, um, every single, uh, what is it? Uh, key on the keyboard. <laughs> All right, here we go, guys. All right, so what I'm doing now here is I just want to cross the finish line, and there's like a question mark about crossing the finish line. So that's why I'm doing this trail for a third time, just because I want to see what the re the secret reward is. Um, Oh, jeez, guys, I was supposed to... Oh, no. Ooh, guys, look at this. Look at this. So, wait a minute. <laughs> we did again. So this... Okay, so free rider means you got to complete the trail with no crashes. Okay, guys. Well, if I crash again, we'll just move on to the next trail. Because this would take a while. I didn't know... Okay, we're dead. All right, I didn't know that was even a thing, like, in the game. Um, so let's let's go back to the menu. Um, so there's a... Apparently, there's a challenge called Free Rider. So that... In that sort of challenge, you need to beat the uh, the trail without any crashes at all. Okay, next uh, trail is Mistfield Forest. That sounds kind of cool. Mistfield Forest. We got uh, seven checkpoints, guys. Uh, let's unlock the challenges. Let's use the boar bike again. We'll use the boar bike again. Uh, I would need, I think, maybe... Actually, I don't know how many... I don't know if I need four... Here we go, guys. I don't know if I need... Woo, this is a really nasty, nasty trail. My gosh, it's so tight. Um, <laughs> more realistic, actually. Um, I think. You know, I've never been... I've been on mountain biking trails, quote-unquote mountain biking trails, even though I don't live you know, in the mountains. But um, I don't know what downhill mountain biking trails really look like. Do they really look like this? All right, here we go. Wee! I mean, if they did look like this, because, I mean, well, some of this is really crazy, you know, like when you're jumping over waterfalls and stuff. But if it was kind of like this and the trail was actually a little wider, like whoa, 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 going between going between trees, guys. I, I've been there, done that, crashing into trees on a mountain bike. Oh, jeez. Oh, do we need it? I didn't know if we needed to sprint there or not. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay, guys. We can die as many times as we want on ouch on the um, explore mode because uh, there's no basically there's no consequences. <laughs> there's no consequences. I'm hitting the sprint button. I should probably slow down a bit. All right, here we go. Trying to think of any other bicycle mountain biking sort of games I've ever played. I've played some you know motorcycle racing games, you know. Oh, shit. and I've seen, I played some sort of futuristic like motorcycle uh, games like Jet Moto back in the day on uh, the PlayStation system. That was pretty fun there. I think they had like three releases of that game back in the day. Boy, that's, that's taking me back. I remember when you used to be able to get uh, CDs like uh, demo discs and stuff. I actually subscribed to, um, what was it? Uh, PlayStation. What? Oh, crap. Let's go up here, guys. I think I was like, I don't know where to go. <gasps> oh, that's, I guess we're all right, guys. Man, the game has just all of a sudden become pretty open world here. Okay, here's the main trail. Uh, I subscribed to a magazine called uh, PlayStation Underground, and every month they'd send you a magazine, uh, but they'd also send you a CD with a bunch of uh, demo uh, demos of different uh, games and stuff. I thought that was pretty cute back in the day. And that's how I found out. Actually, that's how I found out about a lot of games. Oh, no. <gasps> wow, we recovered from that. Now, we would have not have been able to recover with uh, from that with the... Um... Wow, it's gotten all foggy all of a sudden, guys. Or smoky or something. I don't know if there's a forest fire or if it's just the fog. Kind of going through a foresty area. It must be the humidity or something. I don't know, guys. Really foggy now. I don't know how... I don't know what altitude we're at exactly. Not that it really matters. There's another checkpoint. Oh, we're going across a good oh, new guys. I, I, I very much appreciate them putting a checkpoint there because, see, I don't even need it. Woo. I don't even need to move the, um, 
We jumping again, I think. Yeah, pff, right into some rocks. I don't even need to steer when you start right there from that checkpoint because it already has, ow, it already has you lined up perfectly to go across the log. But then I need to adjust over to the right. Oh, jeez. Ooh, the water's deep there, it looks like. It's a river. <laughs> he doesn't usually go, pow. He, he, uh, he screamed there a little bit. You don't usually get to hear the, uh, Okay, yeah, like, ouch, like, I would have been, like, cursing and stuff, but he doesn't do that. I don't know if there's an, op I don't think there's an option in the, um, in the, uh, in the, pfft, in the menu or whatever to turn on profanity or whatever. Actually, the first thing a, a, bi a real bicyclist would be thinking about when they crash is, like, how's, my is my bike okay? <laughs> oh, no. Okay, here we go. I'm gonna go... Slightly to the right. Okay, can I actually... Okay, I can do that without even sprinting. I didn't need to sprint that. Where am I going here? Okay, there we go. All right, we got it, guys. My goodness gracious. My goodness gracious. All right, there's a... Ch Where am I going now? Okay, we're going this way. Cool, cool, cool. All right. <gasps> okay, okay. I don't know, guys. I think I was supposed to go down or something. Look, Looks like there was... Okay, there was a checkpoint right there, at least. <laughs> Jeez. Oh, man. I think I need to actually slow down here a little bit. Going a little too fast. I think you got to go down this way. Wow, okay. Okay. We're following the uh we're following the the waterfall. That's kinda cool. I gotta really go jeez, I can really gotta go slow though. Might be going a little too fast here. Let me go down. Slow. The problem is when you uh okay, I'm just kinda using the brake. Oh wait, I need to go oh I need to I need to go hard left there at the bottom of the waterfall, apparently. Um If you hit the acceleration button uh, it like gives you a little boost, so you don't want to really do that. You just want to kind of, oops, kind of just uh, not have the accelerator on or the brake on. Just kind of let it roll, let the bike roll down, and then uh, maybe feather the brakes a little bit. That seems to be kind of working a little. Wow, that was really, man, what is this? What, do I need to sprint here? I don't know. What the fr Oh, that's insane. That's insane. And plus the, the camera angle. Come on, guys. Come on. This is crazy. The camera angle. No. No, oh, we're in the water. We're in the water. Carmageddon was your favorite game, Kathy, on um, on YouTube. Carmageddon was that kind of like a twisted metal game? Was that a game where you like your your car was uh, equipped with like uh, with guns or something? I, I I've heard of that game before. I don't think I ever played it though. What what uh what game systems was that released on? Oh geez. Man, this is tricky, guys. This is tricky. I don't know how I would have even done this with the grasshopper. All right, we're just going to go slow here because I don't know. I don't know, guys. Oh, no. Oh, man, guys. We had to actually make that jump there. Man, this is... Okay, now the game's gotten, like, crazy tricky now. <laughs> this is the first time where I've had to actually go down a waterfall. I don't know if there's, like, a different way I could go. I didn't see, like, a shortcut or something. Man, this would be this would be fun in real life if you know I was like really good at mountain bike or something. Oh uh, no, really? Okay, I'm just going straight, guys. Oh no, I may. Oh, I'm still alive. I didn't know I was still alive. I didn't know I was still alive there. Oh no, man, guys, I'm gonna have to do this in like so few crashes or less to unlock the next. Yeah, we're going too fast. I hit this. I hit the acceleration button. That was the problem there. Man, this section is difficult. I didn't get to see what. I don't know what uh, checkpoint that was. But, uh, yeah, this is definitely a really tricky section. There we go again, guys. Checkpoint six. Okay, I think there's seven checkpoints, right? So we're near the end of the trail. There's one more checkpoint, and then we get to the uh, the campsite or whatever, and we'll be at the end. Jeez. Yeah, this is tough, guys. This is tough. All right, here, we got to have a little bit of speed going. That was enough speed, guys. <laughs> you got to... I think I need to... I need to hit the acceleration button right on the edge of that ledge. And then, uh, other places here, though, I kind of really just, I'm using the brake, and I'm just letting myself roll down, and trying to get this, the, uh, the steering under control. This is tricky here, so I'm gonna hit, hit, hit the acceleration once. Ooh, looked like I need to hold down the acceleration a little bit there. I didn't want to go too fast, because it's hard to, uh, stop when you're going so fast. Especially since you got, you're in the air. There's nothing you can do when you're in the air, of course. Ooh! <gasps> oh, no! Ah, he's dead. He's dead. Oh, no. That was sad. That was a sad, slow death. It looked like he, uh, he drowned or something. All right, here we go. If you go through the water, it's not, the physics don't exactly uh, make a lot of sense. It was a computer game, uh, Kathy on YouTube, Carmageddon. 
Oh no, what the heck? Okay. Wow, you know what? Actually, I wasn't dead there. I had to hit the death button or whatever to recover. Oh no. Ah, sh Yep, we did. We did. It's okay, guys. Thankfully, we got like infinite tries on this, but, um, man. This is gonna eat up like all my crashes, uh, uh, my crash allowance here, pretty much. All right, hold down the go button. <laughs> hit up the hit up the hit up the stop button. Okay, there we go. There we go, guys. We made it down. We made it down. And there's okay, cool. The checkpoint's right at the bottom. So as long as you get through that, you get the checkpoint. Man, that would be so crazy, insanely difficult in free rider mode, where you have no checkpoints. Because apparently that's a thing now. I was wondering if there was such a mode like that. And apparently there is. It's above the expert mode. Oh, look at that. There's a fork in the road. There was actually a section I might have been able to avoid that whole... This might be the end, guys. There we go. Uh, that was like the same ending as the last time. I guess we had the same campsite at the end of every trail. All right, so now we get to see, like, what are the challenges here to unlock the next trail, which would be trail four of five. So let's see. What do we got to do? We got to do this. Oh, no, guys. We got to do this in so much time or less. We got to do it in two minutes or 30 seconds or less to unlock the next trail. Now, we don't have... There is nothing about, like, how many crashes. I could have as many crashes as I want. And when you start off from a, a checkpoint, uh, you can hit... You, your sprint is, uh, you know revived or whatever your sprint is refreshed or whatever you get all your sprint back so i gotta do this like crazy fast so i'm gonna probably be doing a lot of crashes here guys because i need to do this fast to unlock i think actually it said what two minutes 30 seconds to get uh the next trail unlocked and um man i don't know i'm gonna probably have to do shortcuts and stuff to do that i don't know we'll see what we can do here there was a little shortcut there i missed the shortcut uh, opportunity there there's a checkpoint trying to get around there there we go checkpoint it looks like there's a chance for a shortcut right... Actually, let's just screw it. Let's go this way. <laughs> Maybe we can, like, save a whole bunch of time we go this way. Oh, no. They didn't, the game does not want me to go that way. It wants me to do it the jump here. And then I can kind of cut down this way. I can't see anything there, guys. Maybe I can cut through the, the woods. I can definitely cut through right here. Save a little bit of time. There we go. Um, yeah, I can't even remember the other checkpoints. Like, that one section there with the... Uh, woo. The one section with the... Um, the waterfall, man. I died over and over and over again. Okay, there we go. We got a checkpoint. Oh, I need to save some time. You know what? I'm not, I'm just... Actually, what's over here? Take a break. Uh, that was a take a break location, guys. Uh, you know what? I was going to say, maybe I can just kind of <laughs> just go down the mountain here. I don't know. Okay, now that was too steep there. I couldn't cut through that way. Looking for shortcuts. Ah, crap. We're dead. Doesn't matter. We can do as many crashes as we want here. I'm going to turn it around right here. Looks like we can do a shortcut there. Hit the sprint. There we go. Oh, <laughs> I didn't see the boulders down there. I didn't see it. I couldn't see it. The camera angle wasn't right. All right, I was going to try to... Oh, man, that, that's not really saving me time, but there we go. That might have saved me a little time. I'm out of sprint now. Unfortunately, I'm going to hit the sprint. There we go. Need to find the next checkpoint. Where's that next checkpoint, guys? Where's that next checkpoint? I oh, mean, we're going too slow. Going too slow. All right, where's the checkpoint? There we go. There we got checkpoint. Uh, so you get to start off from the checkpoint. Looking for shortcuts here. It looks like they wanted. It looks like I could have gone up, so I might try that next time. Jeez, man, he's fast, guys. He's fast. You see that when he when he gets out of the saddle and he's like pushing it, man, he's fast. I don't know where that. I don't know where I was gonna go there, guys. I don't know. Looks like you could go up here. Like we go up this way, and then what? Go between those trees, I guess. We can keep going this way. I don't know, guys. I don't know where I'm going. I don't know. Was that faster? I don't know. Oh, I can't even see anything. Okay, I think that might have been a shortcut. Uh, we we're supposed to drop down right there. So we go up high this way, guys. I'm not even using this. I'm not using the sprint. I should probably use the sprint a little bit. Uh, shoot, we over we uh we over uh compensated there. Right, let's go between the trees. Hey, oh, I hit the sprint. Why did I hit the sprint? Okay. All right, easy, easy. We're gonna go kind of slow here. Okay, there we go. We got back on the trail. Fantastic. Okay, so now we next. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we were right at the checkpoint too. We were right at the checkpoint. Okay, we gotta go this way, guys. I think it's gonna save us a little bit of time. I'm gonna try to do it without dying too many times. That dies in too many times. There we go. All right, there's a checkpoint coming up. It's pretty fast. There we go. We got the checkpoint. I don't know what checkpoint number that was, guys. I'm just paying attention to nothing but the trail here it's gotten all foggy this is the foggy section of the trail now i'm sticking really really uh i'm playing it safe i'm playing it real safe sticking to them ow sticking to the main trail so um not gonna be earning myself any time actually it looks like we can go this way i don't know 
and oh, wow that saved us a, a bit of time guys let's keep going let's keep doing that let's keep doing that we can probably save more time by just doing that and go around this way oh no 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 that's too steep that's too steep but it did it is a shortcut there it looks like all right we go around this way keep going over this way and we're on the trail again but it looked like there's another opportunity to jump down here there we go, guys. Oh, man, crap. I don't know where I'm going. Okay, there we go. <gasps> okay, that was good. That was good. I think we saved some time, guys. I think we saved some a bit of time doing that. What sucks is I may still not be doing this fast enough. Probably not. A checkpoint. I just wanted to sprint through that checkpoint because uh, <laughs> it's okay if we die. Our time is uh, 1 minute 40 seconds, and we're at section 6 of 8. And the problem is we're going to get to that section after this. The, the very next checkpoint, it'll be the waterfall. And I'm going to have to go slow at the waterfall because it's so difficult. Um... Let's get to the waterfall. Here's the waterfall. Okay, let's just kill ourselves now. Okay, so we got 1 minute 50 seconds. We got to do this in 1 minute, uh, or 2 minutes 30 seconds. So we got 40 seconds to finish, uh, to finish the trail here. 40 seconds to finish the trail. I don't know if I can just do this really fast. Like, I'm hitting the sprint real hard there. Ooh, let's just, let's just try. We're going to keep trying, guys. Um, because I need to go faster here. All right, we died. So I'm going to be probably dying a whole bunch in this section. I'm hitting the sprint button. <laughs> Whoa, okay. All right, keep going. All right. Oh, man. You know, I'm making a, I'm making a look... Um, I can try to make it look really cool, but it's just going to be completely luck. Not, not really any skill here. All right. Oh, jeez. Ah, we're in the water. We lost time, guys. We lost time. It's okay. Let's just keep going. Let's keep going. Oh, we dead. We almost made it to the bottom, though, that time. But that, the good thing is they let you have as many crashes as you as you want, as you can take. Basically, oh, I hit the hit the boulder there. Ah, jeez, we well, hit the water; it slowed us down. Wow, I hit the sprint. Okay, let's just take the water, guys. I don't know. Maybe we get down faster. We take the water. Uh, Carmageddon was on disc before uh, YouTube. What are you talking about, Kathy? On YouTube. All right, here we go, guys. <laughs> yeah, yeah, screw that. All right, let me hit the uh, accelerator here. All right, down. Oh, no, no, no. I think we're actually kind of had the right idea here. Like like that. There we go, right? I saved a lot of time there. This section here is kind of tricky. I need to hit the uh, hit the accelerator there. I need to hit the brake here. There we go. Get down there. Oh, man, we lost a little bit of time. That's okay. Checkpoint, guys. We got a checkpoint. Fantastic, man. Guys, I did that on, like, the fourth or fifth try, was it? I don't know. So that's really good. Uh, we're at, we need we need to finish now in the next twenty seconds. So that's the problem now. I gotta hit that sprint button. Yeah, we're on section eight of eight. So this is the last section. Uh, we have uh, looks like we have twenty six seconds to get it done. We, if we can do it in 26 seconds, and you know, if I can find a shortcut, <laughs> no, <gasps> that was a shortcut. Oh, amazing, guys! Did you see that? I went down a great descent there, and I still survived. That saved us quite a bit of time. Okay, I gotta do that next time here. So we we just went down the descent here, like crazy, and I recovered. Oh my gosh, that's awesome! I have enough suspension for that, I guess. Now I want to make sure that if I don't quite get the time, <laughs> I want to make sure I kill myself because um. That was too much. That was too much speed. Let me see. Can I actually just sprint over here? I doubt it. Nah, too much speed. But we can actually kind of hit the brake a little, right here, and then drop down. Then I'm hitting the sprint here. Here we go. Whoa, whoa, whoa it's fast. It's fast, guys. Okay, we're on here. Are on the trail. Hit the sprint. Oh gosh, guys. Okay, we did. Oh, we did it. Come on, sprint, dude, sprint. Oh man, we did it, guys. Two minutes twenty seconds. Two minutes twenty seconds. So we got it. Faster than two minutes, 30 seconds, so we unlock the next trail, guys. Yes, yes, yes! We did it, we did it. Oh, I'm so happy. I'm so happy. I'm so happy, guys. Okay, so let's go to Mount Riley. We get to go to Trail 4 or 5, Storm Ledge. Storm Ledge, guys. Looks like there are seven checkpoints on this one. We gotta unlock all the challenges by doing the Explorer mode. We'll use the boar bike. Hmm. So apparently the frame has, like, no stability, but... We have really good shock absorption and grip, so maybe having that really uh, like, per, like maxed out grip is what's making the game a little easier for me. Uh, for, whoa, there's a lot of downed trees on this trail, guys. This is a scary trail. Oh, look at the tree. Wait a minute. I'm just looking at the trees. I can't help but look at the trees. They're all like bent and stuff. There must have been, ow, there must have been like a crazy windstorm that came through here, like a, 
a tornado or something? I don't know. I don't know where, uh, where we're exact. Where is, is Mount Riley a real mountain, guys? Yikes. I think it is. It, no, I'm thinking Mount Rainier. That Rainier, that's, uh, that's in the northwest. Man, geez, man, this is tricky. This is like crazy tricky. I don't know, guys. I don't know. This is this is a really bad, really really tough trail, guys. I mean, it's not not to say that the last trail wasn't also tough. Oh, whoa, we got to go like around and come down that. Ooh, interesting. There was a definitely shortcut I could have taken there though. Oh, jeez. Well, thank goodness I got the right bike for that because I would have just crashed. All right, so we're. Looking for that next checkpoint, guys. I'm not seeing it. Oh, there it is. There's a checkpoint. Yeah, it's almost out. It's almost not crazy difficult, this game, if the game, if the perspective was always right behind... Ooh, right behind the guy. But it's not. It's, like, isometric most of the way. It's definitely a unique game, and it's very fun. But, man, it, it, it definitely has some... Uh, it de it's definitely got this crazy difficulty ramp now, all of a sudden. The last, the last trail and this trail uh, are definitely... Toughest trails I've come across so far. I forget the name of the trail. There's a checkpoint. Oh wow! Whoa, guys, that is like crazy. Um, that that that's why they line you up right here. Okay, I mean, I think you're just supposed to go slow there. There we go. I hold, held the brake. Actually, looks like we can go this way, guys. Let's go this way. Oh no, 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 no. <gasps> that was a shortcut from like a different direction. I think. Oh, I went too fast. I was supposed to use the brake there. I did it again. I <laughs> did it again. All right, hit the, come up to the thing and then hit the brake and go down. There we go. Just like in real life. All right, so now I think that. <laughs> oh, hit the brake. Hit the brake. Here we hit the brake. There we go. And then I think there's a. Uh... Oh, we need to go down. Oh, whoa. Okay. Oh, we're still alive, guys. That's pretty cute. Okay. Wait a minute. <laughs> Got to get out of this. Oh, we get back to the trail. There we go. We're back on the trail. Okay, that was actually a shortcut, guys. All right, cool. Got the next checkpoint. I forget. I think there was like seven checkpoints. Often there is seven. I don't think there's ever more than seven check. They don't ever give you more than seven checkpoints. And each uh, trail in the game has been pretty consistently about, you know, about a three minute long trail, depending on how fast you get through it. Oh, wow. It's wow, those checkpoints are like crazy close together. I'm not sure why. Whoa, it's getting real dark now. And how am I even navigating this? Can't even see nothing. Dudes, this is nuts. I can't see nothing. It's all foggy. Oh, foggy. Wow, look at that crazy bent tree. That's insane. All right, there's another... Okay, there's another checkpoint. All right. I, I, I slammed on the uh, I slammed on the sprint button, so I went, like, way, way further there. Okay, there's the trail. Oh, no, they're not going to get... They're not... They're not getting the smoke. They're not making the smoke go away. <laughs> I thought... Usually, when it goes from checkpoint to checkpoint, they'll... Ow! I, I guess I was going too fast there with this kind of bike. Uh, usually, they get the smoke to go away between checkpoints. Dang, hard to see. Especially with the, the camera angles, too, guys. Oh, my gosh. Oh, no. Oh, I'm surprised I couldn't have recovered from that. I went too fast there, guys. You got to hit the brake right before you jump. I think, with, at least with the spike. Oh, man, guys. All this. It's like all the fog. I'm assuming it's fog and not smoke. Okay, we got a little jump there. We didn't even need to accelerate. It looks like there was actually... looks like I could have done a shortcut by just not making the jump, basically. Oh, no. <laughs> we survived that. That's awesome. That is pretty cute. All right, easy. I'm missing light. I know. Oh, I dedicate this tree to all the poor souls that are going to crash against it and get their good time ruined because of that. Kind regards, Mr. Crash. Okay, whoop. Let's go slow. MC Crash. All right, so, um, yeah, I think sometimes they have, like, little messages uh, of, uh, I think, was this a Kickstarter game? I can't remember. All right, here we go. All the backers. Um, you know what? The smoke's gone. Wait a minute. Was the smoke gone? I don't know. I don't remember. Okay, very good. Man, that was really bad. I was actually angled all wrong there when I landed, but somehow, you know, in real life... Ooh, okay. I don't want to die there again with the same tree. All right, there's a checkpoint. Jump. I don't know, guys. I don't know. We were supposed to jump there. Okay, there we go. We weren't, we weren't lined up properly. Ooh, ow. Okay. I need to hit the brakes, turn to the right. Ooh, okay. Accelerate, turn to the right a little bit. Oh, man. I, I think I need to turn more to the... Ouch. Turn more to the right. Oh, man. This is... That's, that was a... Ooh. How do I turn? I don't know how to turn. I can't back... You can't go back. Okay, I wish screwed you guys. You can't go back. Okay. Actually, I think the answer there was actually don't use sprint. I was using sprint. That was my problem. 
Alright, so I'm not using sprint as I'm going between these jumps now. I'm not using sprint. Alright, there's another checkpoint. Uh, it's getting really flat here. That might have been the last checkpoint, guys. It must be near, uh, I guess near that bridge, right? Because there's always a bridge before the, um, the end, I think, right? Before we get to our campsite. Unless we're coming from a different angle on the trail. On the, oh, jeez. I was going pretty slow there. I wanted to actually try some of these shortcuts. Looks like we got a shortcut option there. There we go. Whoa. Whoa. All right. It's okay. It's all right. Let's go this way. Shortcut, guys. Nice and easy. A lot of shortcut options. Let's just stick to the main trail now. I, I'm really eager to hit the... I really want to hit the sprint, but I can't see since it's coming up. It looks like there's not a lot of... Okay, we can go here. I can see far ahead that I can do a sprint there without any problems. They're going to jump here without the sprint. I probably almost need to use the sprint. Wow, okay. We're going away. Oh, there's another... Oh, that was, the end. that was the end. Okay, so we did come from a different direction, I guess. It looks like a different campsite, though, guys. I don't know. It might be a different campsite than the uh, trail from before. So let's see what our challenges are now for Storm... Wait, what was it called? Storm Ledge. Oh, wow. Okay, so um, there's nothing... There's only, We can only unlock a bike part if we do it in faster time. So let's just go on to the last trail, guys. Trail 5 of 5, Lost Man's Grove. Lost Man's Grove. Um, and there's no unlock mountain because the next... Uh, there's one more mountain I got uh, in this copy of the game... And it's because it's a DLC, uh, which we'll play next week. Uh, so there's nothing really to unlock here. So we'll just go ahead and do the uh, explorer mode with... Uh, wait a minute. What? Oh, I can pick the challenge. Why couldn't I pick the boar bike? Oh, I need to do... I guess I need to do explorer, right? Oh, I've already played... Actually, I've already played this trail uh, from like my first... I guess my first stream or something. I don't know. I played this trail earlier at one point. Um... I think I, I think in my first live stream like two weeks or three or four weeks ago, guys, I unlocked all the mountains, maybe? I didn't know. Unlocked a couple of mountains. So let's just do explore mode. Let's go ahead and uh, go through this. I might have already done this before, but that's okay. Uh, we're going to use the boar bike. I didn't I didn't play it with the boar bike. So this is trail five of five on mountain four of five, guys. So here we go. Here we go. Let's do it, guys. Last trail tonight. Tomorrow, I'll be playing Voices of the Void. Uh, you'll be able to catch me as usual on YouTube. Uh... Twitcher kick. Oh, I, I yeah, I kind of remember this trail now. I did play this like a month ago. This this section was kind of really weird. Ow! <laughs> Ow! It's 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 interesting because it's like you're coming at a first person. Pers uh, you're coming at from you're watching it from behind. Oh, I remember that section there. Yeah, this is this is a really gnarly sort of a trail. You're just doing a lot of jumping down, like going. This is like, this is what I think of when I think of downhill. Like going down some pretty big uh, drops like that. Whoa! That was pretty cool. That was pretty cool. Oh man, they throw you all the way back here. You know what? I think I, I think I played this trail last time with the grasshopper bike, so I wasn't able to do like that. Because we just found ourselves like a shortcut. I don't know. I am just keep going down. Oh wow, I made like crazy amount of, uh, sh that was a crazy amount of shortcuts there. I can't see nothing, guys. The screen's in the way. I couldn't see. I couldn't see. All right, so we are actually able to go here. And then you can go this way. And then you can drop again. Is that right? You can't even see it. But okay, there we go. And I was able to save like a whole bunch of time. I hope I didn't miss a checkpoint. Man, it's hard to, hard to see anything. Oh wow. That guy's lucky he hit that tree before he fell down the cliff because... He probably died when he hit the tree, so that would have been a little more scary if uh, if you get to see your death to fallen from a height like this. All right, here we go, guys. Yeah, this is kind of cool. I like I'm liking that. That's fun. That's fun. And now now the now the nutty section right here, guys. The nutty section. I'm kind of jeez. I it's like I'm using the brake, but I'm like ha half the time I'm airborne here coming down this this section of the trail. But it almost doesn't even matter. I'm going real fast. Oh! Going real fast now. Oh, wow. He's, like, really slow now. Oh, I think I came... Yeah, I came from, like, a... I think that was a shortcut. I, I was coming from a shortcut area or something. I didn't see how many checkpoints there was, guys. I think there's, like, seven checkpoints. Oh, wow. I missed a like, huge chance for a shortcut right back there. That's okay. I think I probably could have gone up the, the hill there, back there, too. In the grass area. But then I would have missed this whole section of the trail. I think one of my favorite things about this game um, is that there seems to be a lot of options in how you beat 
like get from checkpoint to checkpoint. In fact, there's so many options sometimes. Like there's like all these turns I could I could have gone to like the right here several times. Looks like. Um, is sometimes you can miss the checkpoints. I think I did that last last time I was playing this last week. Uh, I was like missing checkpoints. Ooh, I was missing checkpoints. So um, so yeah. Can I go like to the right here? I was missing checkpoints. So um, woo. Uh, yeah, there we go. Well, we just saved like a lot of time doing that. I think. No, no. Let's go, let's go right here. Actually, they got all the they got like all these options. Oh, okay, guys, we're oh wow, we're still alive. Okay, I didn't expect that. Well, this is cool. We can look at all these directions we can go. This trail is really neat. I wish more. I I wish more of the trails were kind of like that, where it's like it's almost more open world. You can go in any direction you want. But I guess when you have a lot of vertical, um, a vertical, you know elevation changes and stuff you're kind of limited in, oh in your options i don't know why he crashed there he seems like he has a pretty good bike with the boar bicycle here i don't know why he couldn't land that it might have been he was he was coming in too hot like too much speed i got the sprint going now there i hit the edge of the uh hit the edge of the little cliff side there so i understand why he couldn't land that maybe i'll uh, not go that way maybe I'll just go this way instead now, can I, like, drop down here? Oh, now there I, I crashed because I turned, like, mid-air or something. And I was facing the wrong way in, in terms of the direction my momentum was taking me. So, of course, I crashed. All right, here we go, guys. Oh, man, why do I hit sprint? I always like to hit sprint right there. I hit sprint right there, and then I crash. I have a... Ten wow, how are we still alive? Oh, he did that. He was like a slow death. You can see him like try. Like he was trying, but the game already said, "Yeah, you know, game over." He was still trying to climb up the hill after he got the game over. That's funny. I think your game wants me to go actually this way, but then I want to drop down here, and then let's keep going this way. I guess I don't know, guys. Wow. Okay, man. I don't even know where. Ooh. Oh, there was a checkpoint. Man, this is crazy. I don't actually remember this part of the trail. Uh, there's like all these options, so I'm like going this way to the right. I could stick to the main trail. I'm not sure what's the fastest way of going. I'm gonna go this way now. I'm gonna go down this way. Okay, I think my problem has been I've been using there's a the checkpoint. I was using the I just kept trying to use the sprint button, guys. And that was that was throwing me off. It probably can be done with the sprint, it's just you need a little bit more practice. Now it looks like we can totally jump down here, guys. All right, there we go. Let's try. Oh, now that's a little steep there. That's a little steep. Let's go down a little further before we try to do that. Actually, we can go around it. And then it looks like we can easily, pretty easily jump down here. I'm going to sprint here, guys. There we go. All right. Cool, cool, cool. That was, that was checkpoint five, guys. I think there's only two more checkpoints. Using my sprint here. Yeah, he doesn't have much sprint, but he does seem to be a strong rider, though. He's got a lot of, uh, a lot of speed. He has a pretty good top speed, I think. Why don't I just cut through, like, over this way, guys? Like, just cut through all this. Oh, there's a checkpoint over here. I gotta get the checkpoint, though. That was checkpoint six. There's only one more checkpoint, guys. And then the final section to the, uh... To the, um... Whoops. I need a sprint there. Oh, man. I turn. See, I turned my wheels when I was mid-air there. And so I, I landed without my wheel f uh, front-facing, basically. So I think that's why I crashed. Alright. I want to land and then hit the, uh... Hit the brake. Go fast there. Because you can do a lot of crazy steering. Uh, this is the end, guys. I think this is the end. A lot of crazy steering and still recover. Oh my gosh, guys. We did it. So that was the end of Mount Riley. That was Mount Riley. So let's go ahead and... Oh, we didn't get to see what the time was exactly. I wasn't really paying attention. That's okay. Uh, because it was um, explorer mode. So next week, guys. Next week, we're going to do the final mountain. Mountain 5 on Lonely Mountains Downhill. Um, I still only have two bike parts, so I'll probably just play as the board bike. I got a pretty cool, uh, you see there's like a really cool, um, paint job on that bike. I'm really liking the paint job. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. I'm Wayback Guy. We'll see you tomorrow. More Voices of the Void on Indie Wednesday. And, uh, you can, again, check me out on my Discord, Discord at WaybackGuy.com. You can also, uh, check me out every weekday. I play another game, uh, on here, on YouTube, Kick, and, uh, Twitch, of course. Uh, and, and if you have any game suggestions, you can always leave them in the chat. You can leave them uh, in, under a video comment on YouTube or uh, just hit me up on uh, Discord. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. See you next time. Oh, boy. I can't wait till next week. I can't wait till next week. Final mountain, mountain five, guys, mountain five. Looks like there's um, four trails.
Let's do it.